everybody hope you're doing well let's get some departed messages from your loved ones this early saturday morning it looks beautiful out there's no snow the sun is bright but ooh, that cold chill will steal your breath it's freezing <laughs> wearing shade okay Somebody's out here clearing their name, or if someone's out here saying some shit about you, they're going to get it. Your loved one says, you think of me when you're trying to go to sleep? I think we think a lot, mostly, about our day when we're going to sleep in general, but I think you've been thinking about this person lately. You picture me scared and alone and suffering, but baby, it was all so quick, I barely felt a thing. Upon my last breath, I thought of you, wishing to kiss your face one last time. I did not suffer, baby. I was not alone. I was not scared. You need to let go or let these feelings go. I don't know what happened here. Um, this is clearing the shade. Your perception of how this person died is wrong. They did not suffer. It was quite peaceful for them. They want you to accept this and stop going to a dark place so that you don't have these horrific dreams at night or go through this every night when you're trying to sleep. September could be relevant here. Back to school, fall time. I heard teacher for some of you. Always in my heart. As much as you think of me and miss me, I do the same for you. We are always connected. In my heart, you live. And in yours, I live. You are connected. You are always together. Was it my fault? This is a question you ask yourself. No, baby. Now is exactly what I heard. I'm scared for you. If you keep going on the way you're going, you're going to end up alone. You're not happy. You're lashing out and being hard to live with. You need to get some help for that temper. I love you. This is not who you are, even if you know that. We all need help sometimes. Don't go down a bad path. Change it now. For some of you, you're being spiritually manipulated. Your house is haunted. This is confirmation. Others of you, you're going through it and you're taking it out on the people around you and this is the first thing that they want you to focus on because they don't want you to lose people that you genuinely love because you're not communicating that you're struggling. All right, let's see what else. Anything from this one? Walk of shame. Maybe you, you cheated on somebody or um, you're just coming home drunk a lot. You defend me. Okay, so maybe this person that passed away um, that's coming through didn't have a lot of people that uh, had good things to say about them. And you still defend them. They're acknowledging it. The activist. This person could have been very into that kind of thing. Whew, I'm getting short of breath. That could be relevant here. Everything is a clue to who this person is. Or you could be currently taking part in uh, change. We have country life. I heard country bumpkin. You will have a baby. I know you're worried. I know you think you're missing out right now. Or that it may never come. All in divine timing, my love. You were born to be a parent and it will happen for you. Just come. Maybe go to the country. Get out of the city. Get out of the activism that makes you stressed out. Love will come and go, baby, but you can't... A lot of babies today, but you can't let it crumble your whole world when it does end. It just means that wasn't the one for you. Be patient. Be kind to yourself. Everything is a learning curve. Love will come and it will stay when it's meant to. Don't rush it. You, I feel like some of you just don't like to be alone. But sometimes, listen, I've spent three years on my own and I am the happiest I've ever been because I love myself and I know myself and that comes from being alone. 
learning to stand on your own feet emotionally, being your own best friend, connecting with other friends. I'm always looking out for you and all those you love. Don't worry. I'm always going to make sure you all end up okay. I'm protecting you all. Do what you can to stay safe. I'll do the rest. Don't worry. Um, so if you live in a troublesome area, they're always walking you home at night. They're always, you know, riding shotgun, trying to give you, you all a heads up and keep you safe. I was not scared. I did not feel the pain. It was numbed by the angels. And they took me home in their warm, loving light. It was peaceful. I want you to know that. See, confirming peaceful. This was a, um, a homicide. Uh, sexual assault or rape was associated. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm shouting out details that might be, again, look, fall. They could have fell. They were found in fall in September. Or September could be their birthday or yours. Suicide. I feel like you defend this person. This is the one that's saying you defend me because maybe people pick on them still, even though they committed suicide. You're the coolest person I know. I'm your number one fan. Maybe you've been thinking of suicide. This person's like, why? Like, fuck all those people. Like, you just gotta find your place. You gotta find your tribe. Those, this isn't your place and that's not your tribe. Don't listen to them. Mommy and Daddy, I left you before I could speak my heart. But I want you to know I love you very much. Oh, I'm sorry. I know you love me very much. I love you so very much, too. I skipped a line. I'm okay. The angels watch over me, and one day we will get this, that time you long for. Please don't be so sad. I only want you to be happy. Don't worry. I'll always be with you. So I think you're going to get a rainbow baby because you got confirmation. Well-liked. <laughs> you are a well-liked person. People like you a lot. They love this about you. You're very sweet. You're definitely going to have that baby back in your tum-tum or your wife. <laughs> Even a surrogate, if you need to, it'll, it'll find its way back. Anything else that you would like to tell your departed loved ones today? I switched so they might, um, whew, flag down. Shout out to my Irish people. It's almost our day. <laughs> Uh, I see so much of myself in you, how you think, how you feel, the choices you've made. I feel responsible for your pain. I feel you tried to walk in my shoes too closely, and because of it, it brought you deep pain. I'm so sorry your heart is so bruised. I'm so sorry this happened to you, too. I'm here with you. You're never alone. I hope you know I'll do anything to help you be all right again. I love you. Some of you were also uh, sexually assaulted. Oh, they were with you. Work accident, died by accident, faulty systems. Hmm, interesting. And then this cap, stroke, heart attack. I feel like there's a couple spirits here. All attached to you. When your time comes, my love, I don't want you to fear it. Death is not this horrific thing most people believe it to be. It's beautiful. It will be for you too. I'll be there to see you through it. The talent. You're the talent. You have such talent. They're so proud of what you do, even if you're hiding it from the world. Only you can say who is or is not right for you to love. Exactly. Follow your heart. Set yourself free. Don't carry it anymore. Don't carry it. This person's death anymore. Don't carry any responsibility. They literally confirm that it's not your fault. They just want you to focus on your talents and be vibrant and get help and live happy. I'll see you next time. I hope this was helpful. Love and light. Bye.